Hi, in this video, we're going to look at how we begin editing a podcast. Now, we're going to use Logics in this podcast. So this is a Mac application. Maybe you're using Audacity for PC, or maybe you're using GarageBand. In any case, it all works about the same. But this is the system I use, so this is what I'm going to show you on, uh, knowing that you might have to make some allowances based upon what you're doing. The first thing we need to do is we need to get our audio files. Now, you should have recorded using Zoom, and you should have saved your recordings in the cloud, not locally. So what you need to do first is log on to Zoom, and that's uhd.zoom.us, and then you'll find your Zoom account, and then you'll log into your Zoom account. Once you're in there, click on the recordings link on the left-hand side of the menu. And then you're going to find the session that you recorded that you want to use the audio files from. So in this case, we're going to use uh, 19th century gun laws, and this is TTH, Talking Texas History. And we recorded this on February 29th of 2024. So I'm going to click on that link, and then I'm going to go down and find the audio files for each participant. Now, what Zoom does is it records all of the audio files on separate tracks. That's very helpful if uh, you're, some person coughs, you can edit that cough out. If somebody gets up to go somewhere else and there's noise in the background, you can edit all that out if you have the different tracks. And I'll show you a little bit of that as we get into the video itself of how I edit. So once I select each individual audio file, I'll get, uh, in this case, three files. My co-host, Scott Sosby, and then our guest, uh, Brennan Rivas. And so I'm going to download those. What you'll see is that in each of the files, there are three options. You can download it or create a link or trash it. So I'm going to download each of these files and you'll see that it's saving them. So because I'm going to be using several different file windows, I'm going to open up everything on my computer screen. So let me open up Logics. What I'm going to do here is uh, go to the last tab that I ordered. Now, if you're using Audacity, if you're using Audition, or if you're using uh, GarageBand, for example, uh, these are other software types that are available for you, and they're very good for editing. You can do it in this. I just choose Logix Pro because uh, I have a Mac, and uh, GarageBand is also the free Mac software, but I have this as an updated version. So I'm going to open this project, which is already existing, because I'm going to uh, add some other things into the program. So first of all, I'm going to choose this. I'm going to skip. It's going to open up a blank version. Well, actually, this is a populated version. So what I want to do is um, show you how I do this. Let me zoom this down so you can see. Uh, the shows are about 30 minutes, give or take a few minutes. I have some intro material up here. I have an intro material up here. And then I have a music bid at the beginning and then at the end. And in between here are three different files. Now I'm going to highlight these because I'm going to delete these. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to import. The first one was Brennan, so I'm going to change the name uh, on the screen. And then I'm going to import her file. And this is going to take a little bit of time to translate it from one format to another. So I've got Scott on there. I've got myself. Um, and I've got Brennan. So what we're going to do now is uh, I'm going to, this is the beauty of the digital. I'm going to expand this screen out because this is what I want to focus on. I don't want too many windows open because that's going to 
impinge upon my computer's performance. But what I do want to do is I want to line these up so I know that they're accurate. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to expand this as much as I can. And what we're going to see here is that although if you do a close up, it looks like I had set them all very close together. If we do a, a, a zoom in, a real deep zoom in, we're going to find out that what happened is that um, they're not really nested up together. So and I want to line them up so that they are as close to being accurate as and on the mark with one another as I can. And you're not going to have any noticeable difference now in uh, the synchronization of these three together. So now what you can do is you can see that there is the, the give and take, the conversation is much more aligned as it really was when we were doing it. So what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do now is go to the beginning of our recorded interview. I put a three, two, one countdown so I know where we start and I know where I'm gonna cut. I don't really want anything before that. So I'm gonna delete that. So here's all right. You guys ready? So I'm about to start the actual show. So I'm gonna find out where that three, two, one is, and I'm gonna cut it there. Ready. All right. Ready. Three, two, one. Now, you heard me start a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back just right before that three. There's the three, two, one. One. And I'm going to cut it right here. What I'm highlighting is what I'm going to do an action on. And in this case, I'm going to delete them. So I'm deleting that. Again, I have these somewhat lined up. I'm going to scrunch down so I can move this over to where the music begins because I want this to come in over the music. So here's my music bed, and I've got an introduction. You notice the music bed, the volume goes down for a while, then it comes up. This is where I'm doing the introduction. So here is what people are going to hear when they start the tape or the, the whenever they start the program. This podcast is not sponsored by and does not reflect the views of the institutions that employ us. It is solely our thoughts and ideas based upon our professional training and study in the past. The music comes up. Welcome to Talking Texas History, the podcast that explores Texas history before and beyond the Alamo. Not only will we talk Texas history, we'll visit with folks who teach it, write it, support it, and with some who made it, and of course, all of us who live it and love it. Now that's about that. So there's my intro, and then you see that the music starts tapering down. What I want to do is I want to drag these so that it starts somewhere in the intro uh, after the music kind of goes up and comes down again. So here's what it's going to sound like. And of course, all of us who live it and love it. Welcome to another edition of Talking Texas History. I'm Gene Freus. I'm Scott Sosman. Gene, we've got a lot of people on for a long time, and we're in Texas, and we're talking about Texas history. And how have we never had anybody on to talk about guns? How, how did that happen? Isn't it part of the Texas mystique? Uh, that's what I've been told. So we better find out more about it then. So why don't you introduce our guest? Well, we have Brennan Rivas. And uh, Brennan, tell us a little bit about yourself. Hi, Gene and Scott. I'm glad. To so I've got a little bit of a gap there, and I want to get rid of that gap. So I'm going to, again, expand so I can see it a little bit clearer. And I want, I've got a kind of a, uh, there's 0106 from when I ask her, and there's 0108 when, before she responds. I want to cut out some of that. So I'm going to come to about right there. I'm going to click split. And right before she answers again, I want to give it a little bit so people will allow her to take a breath. I'm going to split it again. Oops. I'm going to take out this. I'm going to highlight this. 
and I'm going to scoot that over. Now, I'm going to continue to do this throughout the show. Bit about yourself. Hi, Jean and Scott. I'm glad to be here. All right. Thanks so much. Yeah, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end it here. There's a goodbye there. And I noticed that at the end of the show, we talked for a while after, but at the end of the show, uh, we didn't really say goodbye. Scott had to leave early. Thanks. So I'm going to close the edit there. And then this part in the middle is just where there's general talking. So I'm going to delete that. And I'm going to bring where people say goodbye. I'm going to move these over here. Let me zoom in to make sure that I'm closing in this gap. Move these right there. And so here's what you're going to hear at the end. And I'd love to do it again sometime. All right. Thanks so much. Yeah, thank you. Bye-bye. And so there's there's an ending. Now, it's still at 35. And there's some other things that I want to cut out, uh, and I'll do that uh, separately. But you kind of get the idea of how the editing is done. At the end, what I'm going to do, I can move my music over here and you can see that I've got a volume set here. I want our talking to end in this up ramp before it gets to the end. So I'm going to do this about right there. Here's what it's going to sound like. Some new ideas on perspectives that that are historical but we we really don't You hear the music there. gradually this building is, towards the end. Your yeah. Thank you very much. This, is, this has been one of our better ones. Oh, well, thanks. I'm I'm very glad to have participated. I'd love to do it again sometime. All right. Thanks so much. Yeah, thank you. Bye-bye. And then it builds to the end and drops off. That's where I'm going to stop it. Now, I actually do need to do some more editing to clean it up, tighten it up a little bit. And I'm going to do that as I go along. But... For the sake of this, I want to show you how I close this out. So I go to File. I'm going to go down here to a menu item called Bounce. Now, Bounce, I don't know where this term comes from, but it's where you bounce all of the information into a finished product. And so I'm going to bounce this over. I'm going to bounce everything, the project of the section. I've got these presets to what my uh, podcast host asked me to set it to. So this is their format that I've already pre-set in there. And I'm going to start this at the beginning. Now, this isn't exactly... Uh, one of the things I'm not sure I don't like about this is that the I've got to reset the time each time, and that's kind of a pain in the neck. So I'm starting it at 000, and I'm ending it at 3527. So here it is, the 35, 28, 21. Okay, I'm going to change this to 27. Oops. You get the right, the right field here. 27.01. Let's just say 0 0.02 or 0 0.3. Just, uh, well, I could just say 02. And there, there we'll have it. That's where it ends. So now that I've got everything set, I've got the proper time, I click OK. And what happens, I'm going to make sure I change the name. Uh, and this is Guns. That's actually not the name. It's probably going to be Gun Laws. I'll probably change that later on. But uh, what it's doing now is it's compressing it all this into a single file. Okay, so now that that's finished, here's what I'm going to find. I'm going to find that I've got a WAV file. WAV, the WAV file. This is what I need to upload to my Buzzsprouts. So what I can do is go to my Buzzsprouts, log in. I would upload a new episode. Drag it and drop it here. It's going to upload it. And it's going to take a little bit to upload it. Okay, 
And so now it's processing and it'll take a while to do it. I'm not going to bother you with that, but that's essentially what I do to get my podcast going. I'll show you more about it later on in the next video. Okay. Thanks.